everybody, David Chesworth here, wellness coach at Hilton Head Health, and it's time for another Fitness Friday. Today we're going to do a concept of 20-20-20. It's a new fitness fad and also a new fitness class here at Hilton Head Health. The idea behind it is 20 minutes of cardio, followed by 20 minutes of strength training, followed by 20 minutes of core and stretching. So the first thing I'm going to show you today, an option for cardio. We're going to be mixing up with the step. The first thing that we'll do is we'll do 20 jumping jacks. High impact looks like this. Low impact, you can just do one foot at a time. We'll do 20 repetitions of jumping jacks. Immediately after that, we'll go into 20 box jumps. Jumping, landing softly in the center of the step. Step down, jump, we'll go to 20. Low impact for box jumps, it can be step ups. Two, we'll do 20 of those. The next exercise we'll go into will be lateral jumps from back to forth. This is the high impact, low impact, we can just do lateral steps. We'll do 20 of those, followed by toe touches. So we'll have one toe starting up on the, on the step, jumping back and forth. One, two, 20. Low impact, you can just step, step, tap, tap. And finally, for the cardio, we're going to do 20 burpees. Starting down here, pressing up, jump and clap. Low impact version. We'll just do an up-down. Go down, touch your ankles, stand up and clap. We'll repeat that sequence for 20 minutes for our 20 minute cardio. Next we'll go into strength. So the strength exercises we'll do today, we'll grab a set of dumbbells. First one we'll do is front squat. So we'll place these dumbbells up on our shoulders, elbows out pointing forward, feet shoulder width apart, wiggle those toes to keep the weight in the heels. Proud chest, push that tush back. Sit down as low as you can go, drive up through those heels, one, 20, good. Next we'll go into lunges, we'll just do 10 per leg, we'll take a step out with our left leg first, up on the toes with our back foot, lower our back knee towards the floor, notice how my knee doesn't pass over my toes like that, that's bad. Back up, one, 10, then I'll switch sides, one, 10, good. Next we'll go into shoulder press. Bring those dumbbells up, elbows are rough, a little past 90 degrees. Press up, dumbbells touch together at the top. My ears are near my arms. My arms aren't up front. Back here, two, 20, come down. Then we'll go into an upright row. Palms facing our legs. Pull up with our elbows, dumbbells come to the bottom of the neck, top of the chest, down. 20, good. And lastly, we'll do reverse slides. So we'll stand, feet about shoulder width apart, strong posture, not a rounded out back, nice slope, dumbbells together, elbows slightly bent, bring those elbows out wide, or er, those arms out wide and pinch those shoulder blades together at the end. We'll do 20 of those. Repeat that sequence for 20 minutes, and then we'll go into core and stretching. So the first core exercise we'll do will be sit-ups, put our feet in a butterfly position, lie back, Hands over our head. Crunch up, pull that belly button in towards the spine, touch those toes. Back down. 20 of those low impacts. You can just do crunches, feet flat on the ground. Crunch up one, two, 20. Next we'll go into the awkward turtle. Awkward turtle, hands down by our side, feet flat on the ground. Lift those shoulders off the ground, swivel back and forth, trying to touch your heel with your hand. Tap, tap to increase the difficulty. Try touching your opposite heel with your opposite hand. Next we have reverse crunches, high impact. You can put your hands underneath your bum to, to help you relieve pressure from your low back. You'll simply lift your legs up straight, lift your hips off the ground, come back down. Don't let those feet touch the ground again. We'll do 20 of those, low impact. You can have your knees bent. Bring those knees to your chest, back down. We'll do 20 of those. And finally our last core move. It's called the jackhammer. We're going to have our arms over our head, legs flat on the ground. We'll bring either our opposite hand to our opposite leg, back down, two, 20, or you can do both arms at the same time. Or if you're really daring, you can do both arms and both legs. Tap, tap. We'll do 20 of those. After that, you can stretch it out. And that's your 20, 20, 20 workout. Hope you've enjoyed it.